Good afternoon. So, just wanted to give you a quick tutorial again on your Delta Math. Um, when you go into today's and tomorrow's assignment, it's the same assignment. Um, so, here's one of the questions. They give you the focus and the directrix, and they give you the graph, um, which you should sketch on your own paper, like we did in the beginning, so that you can figure out what the vertex is or and P or any other of the missing pieces, depending upon what you are given. So once you review that with your, um, whether you go back and look at the videos or your notes or what have you, um, for this first question, I discovered that the vertex is one negative one and that P is seven. So when you go type it into the computer, everything right now is labeled for you. So it is a vertex of one, negative one. You've got a p-value for this question of seven, and then it gives you a toggle here to tell me which way the graph is going. Remember that the graph always goes away from the directrix. So if my directrix is vertical, my graph is going either left or right, depending upon where my focus is. It always goes towards your focus. So for this question, when, I, when you graph it, here's my directrix, my focus was over here, so my graph goes towards that, which means that it opens to my right. So once you fill in your pieces, you're going to submit it, and it will tell you if you're right or wrong, um, and then you can move on. It will also give you how to find these things. Um, we have our videos on that that I made for you. Um, it's up to you, whatever you, is best for you. This is yet just another way to do it. Good luck.